So Alaska had a pretty neat idea. We have never done this with a dog, but we're gonna see how it works. She has drawn a circle on the driveway here with chalk, and we are gonna try and teach Dale to go inside the circle and to not come out unless we tell him that he can come out. So And the um word is chalk. And we're gonna call it chalk. So I'm just gonna walk up to him or walk up to here with him. We'll say chalk. Yes. Good job. I'm gonna tap on his foot there so he gets that in. Yes. Good job. And I got too many remotes. I'm gonna stick one of these in my pocket. Good job, buddy. Good job. Break. Very good. And we're gonna do that again. This way, bud. Very good. Yo, chalk. Yes. Very good. Very good. So notice when I say yes really excitedly, he knows that that's a good thing and that that means food is coming. So he immediately just stops or sits down. So that's good. He doesn't necessarily necessarily have any idea that he's inside a circle that we've drawn yet. Yeah, he hasn't even looked at the ground. He hasn't even looked at the ground. So break. I'm gonna release him so he can have another successful rep before he even knows what he did necessarily. And I'm gonna do that one more time, just like that. Deal. Chuck. Yes, very good. And I'm also giving him stem on his e-collar uh, from the moment that I give him the command, which is, like I said, brand new. We've never done this before until he's inside the circle, which is what I want, and then I release. So he's getting uh, a, a sensation on his neck. He's getting that stimulation from the time until he's given a command until the time he does the command. And then as soon as he does, that stimulation goes away and I mark it and I, boom, give him a reward. So we're gonna release again, feel break. Very good. So we've done this three times no, now. No, now this no, time, no, 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 no. we're gonna do the same thing, but before I release him immediately, I'm gonna try to walk away and see if he tries to step out or not. Dale, chalk, yes. Very good, and that time he was getting ready to overstep, so I gave him just a little bit of uh, leash pressure backwards. All I did was go like this, so when he got here, he felt that and he just stopped. So he is right there on the edge of there. So I'm just gonna see what he does when I step back. So naturally- He's pressing the chalk-a-ding-dong. The chalk-a-ding-dong, yeah, a little dot drawn in the circle. So if he steps toward me, I'm going to correct him and use my body language and some e-collar sensation to get him back in there. And then I'm gonna reward as soon as he's back in here again. Hope I don't run out of food while we're doing this. And- we'll He likes the he smell of your shorts. He keeps bending his neck over. Yes, very good yeah. for staying there. I'm gonna test it again. Good. Good, yes. And we're gonna release. Break. Very good job, very good job. So he still doesn't necessarily know what's going on. What I like to see if I'm teaching something like this that's brand new is that he'll test it, meaning he'll step out. And when I correct him, he'll know how to turn the, the stem off. So ultimately what I would like to see is I try to walk away and he tries to follow, this he steps out of the circle, and, and then I nice. got a little distraction going on here with those snakes. And then when I give him a correction, he knows exactly what to do in response to that. So that's, that's kind of an indicator for me, telling me that he's retaining this. Chalk? Yes. Very good, very good job. I think that he, I think he looked at the ground. Yes. But I don't think he noticed that Good that job. was still left. Good job. So I'm adding a little bit more distraction. I'm going to walk a circle around him, see what he does. Very good boy. Very good. Yes. And I'm in intermittently uh, giving him rewards. Dad. To... No, don't do that right now. Don't don't bring that over here. I'm going to try to do different angles. Yes. Very good. Please don't do that. Don't do that by him. Not so close. Because that if, if he runs away from that, then it'll make it harder to tell if he's understanding what we're teaching him. So that we would do after he understands clearly. He's shown us that he understands what chalk means. And then we're trying to kind of test him there. But right now we're kind of seeing if he even gets this. Good job, buddy. Nope. Chalk. Yes. Very good. Very good. So there. Uh, again, he, he may have been just responding to my body language because I stepped toward him. But when I said no chalk, I pressed the stem again because he was outside of the boundary. And then as soon as he took a couple steps back, I released reward. 
So that's good. That was a good sign. Good job. Nope. Chuck. Yes. Very good. And the same thing there again. Good job. Good job. Yes. Very good. And he did not try to come toward me that time when I squatted down. It's a very inviting body language. Break. Good job, buddy. Good job. I like that he knows that he can move as soon as I say break. We're going to try this again. I think we've done, what, probably six, six or seven reps so far. Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. You didn't know he was going to do some some brand new command today, did you? Very good, bud. Deal. Chuck. Yes. Very good. And that time I let him go uh, ahead of me, so I did not walk him in there. He walked in on his own. And I think I've got like three kibble left. Good chalk. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yes. So he kind of had his foot on the line there. Very good. Very good job, buddy. Good job, Dale. Good. Cool. Good job. Good. Messing with the yes. big snake. So there I just threw a piece of kibble out on the ground, and he watched it roll, but he did not go for it, so that's good. I mean, Raider would eat it. He tried putting kibble in his mouth, but yeah. he spit it out because he's a human being. Good. good. Break. Very good. So, um, I would say pretty good. Uh, pretty good for our first uh, little lesson on chalk. Um, this, um, I might end there. Come on, bud. And we could test it another day, perhaps tomorrow if the weather's nice, just to kind of see how he does if he shows more that he understands and we can kind of throw in some more distractions now that we've done some reps but we won't do too many all at once since it was brand new and he could kind of get overloaded uh do you have anything to add to that if it does rain you can just make it again we can just draw another circle no problem well that was a great idea alaska brand new command today good job dale way to be a, a good guinea pig well, um, I think he got that from the flying squirrel that was in our house. We did have what we believe to be a flying squirrel in our house It was. Today. We researched it on uh, Google, and we saw a picture that looked exactly like it. And chipmunks have more white on them. That is so amazing that we had that in our house today. That, yeah, it actually went gliding off this deck and right there, and then just scattered away off to the woods. Yeah. We live in... Um, lots of woods. Other people started basing their houses now. <laughs> Alright, let's let's kill the video. Yeah.